Hi boys and girls. Today we are going to learn about a new text type, event programs. When events are long and have lots of different parts, we usually get an event program, like these two. So this one is the example on your book page 27. Event programs are given to the audience, guests or participants at events. This word audience means the people who come to watch the show or to listen to the show. Guests or participants means that the people come to the show to look at it or to do something at the event or to do something at the show. So normally the events programs give you some general information. For example, the date and the venue. Venue means the place, the where. And sometimes it gives extra information about each part of the event. For example here, the time, 9am, and the event is about a welcome speech by the principal. That means the thing that they are going to do at 9am. And here you can see under the event, there's a name. The person responsible, Miss Amy Ho. What does it mean? That means the welcoming speech, this event, this activity will be held by this person. So that means Miss Amy Ho will do the welcome speech here. Some information is detailed with names of speaker, types of prizes, etc. So if you don't know prizes, that means this, awards. So prize presentation here, you can see there the three winners of the Protected Environment Painting Competition and the three Environment Monitors of the Year. And then the name of the speaker, that means who will do the speaking, talking, and who will give the event and who will give out the prizes is this one, the name under the event. So this one is a bit special. Notice that inside the brackets after the names, we can find the person's position or job. So you can see here, Mrs. Connie Wang is the name. Director, Save the Earth Association. Member of the BPS Parent Teacher Association. This is her title. That means, what does she do as a job? So give you an easier example, I can write Miss Fong. So Miss Fong is the class teacher of 6LD, right? So you can write Miss Fong, bracket, class teacher of 6LD, close bracket, something like that. So for this one, italic letters show this is the name of the musical, the name of the show. You can see here, the letters are like this, the words are not straight. So this is italic, mm -hmm. italic means this. The letters are not straight. And then that means it's the name of this musical. Stop killing our planet. A welcome speech comes at the start to greet people. That means to say hello, welcome to the people. And a closing speech comes at the end to thank people for coming. This word speech means talking. Something like what he is doing. So we have a timetable at school. 6A has a timetable, 6B has a timetable, and so on. So events programs are like timetables. They both show times and activities. However, timetables are simpler with more basic information. So here, for example, for a school timetable, you can see 8.30 a.m. to 9.05 a.m. is English lesson. So we just say English. So in events programs, like timetables, we can quickly check information. For example, which activity happens at 10.30? Hmm. Is this 10.30 a.m. here? Right. So that means Protect the Environment Painting Competition Oh, will be held at 10.30 a.m. Okay, so you can learn something by reading the time and the name of the event. Hmm, which activity happens at 11.35? Wait, I see 11.30, I see 11.40. Oh, 
we can use the start time of this activity and the next activity to find the answer. So, can you tell me which activity happens at 11.35? So now, let's look at another one. I'll give you some time to read this one first. So, first question, what event is this event program for? So let's say this is a paper, something that you get from an event. What does it tell you? Yes, that's right, a speech festival. Is there a break? Yeah, some of you may know. At 11 a.m., there's a spe this special word, refreshments. Yes, there is a break. Refreshments means there is a break in which drinks are served, sometimes food also. So in short, this word, refreshments, means food and drinks. Hmm, what happens at 13.40? Ah, you can use these two times to find out. It is the award ceremony. Hmm, at what time will Sandy Quark thank people for coming? Hmm, I can see the keyword is thank, but I don't see thank here. Ah, I remember. Just now, we learned that one of the activity is talking about someone has to thank people for coming. Hmm, which is it? Yes, the closing speech. She will thank people during the closing speech at 1.45 p.m. So this is the end, but it's not finished yet. So for today's homework, you need to go to your book, your e-book, on your iPad, or on your real book. Go to book page 27. You can see the event program that we have just read. Mm -hmm, this one, the green one, about Green Day. And then there are three questions that you have to answer. So try your best to answer the questions. I think you can do it. So this is the end of the lesson. Bye-bye.